Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get Autopilot++ and the Flight Management Computer or FMC for GOFS, which is an online web browser flight simulator. Now these two extensions uh, work and we can install them by using Tamper Monkey, a Chrome extension, to modify the actual script of GOFS to allow us to have these awesome extensions. And well, while that sounds pretty complicated, it's actually much more simple than you might think. So let's jump into it. So the first thing uh, to do before we actually start to install the, uh, before we start to download, sorry, the uh, Autopilot++ Plus Plus and FMC, we need to install Tamper Monkey. And you can do this pretty easily by going uh, to a new tab in Chrome and going to these uh, nine dots right here called Google Apps and then scroll all the way down and you'll find Chrome Web Store. You can just click on that right there. And uh, this also works on Firefox and you can just, in, instead of it called Tamper Monkey, um, search up Grease Monkey. But if we're using Chrome, which I'm sure you are, most people are, you can type in Tamper Monkey. So Tamper Monkey, and then just click enter. Oh, I misspelled that. And then um, click this first one that pops up. It should just say Tamper Monkey, not Tamper Monkey Beta, just Tamper Monkey by TamperMonkey.net. And click on that, and then just go ahead and click Add to Chrome. And then, so this, um, you want to allow this, so this will actually let it read and modify GeoFS's code. Just like that. There we go. So let's go ahead and pin this. Okay, well. We don't really need this. Let's go ahead and um, click the little puzzle piece right here and then click this little uh, pin icon. And that way it'll always show up uh, wherever we are so we have access to it. So what we need to do is we need to give uh, Tamper Monkey permission to modify uh, the scripts. So this is pretty simple. All we need to do is type in um, in our search bar um, Chrome uh, settings. And then instead of clicking here, click on the uh, little uh, oval that says manage settings. And this will take you right here. And you want to click on extensions right here. And then you'll see all the extensions that, you, um, that you've installed. So over by Tamper Monkey, make sure you have this checked and click on details. And what's really important, we want to first make sure that this says on all sites right here. And then we want to click allow access to file URLs. This is really important. This will allow the files that we're going to install into Tamper Monkey, it'll allow it to um, pretty much read it. And then um, if you use it in incognito, I'd go ahead and check this as well, but it's still worth, uh, but if you don't, I'd still check it. And once that's all done, um, you can close out of these two both. So now what we need to do is we need to download the scripts. So go down to the video description and click on and open the two links that say uh, FMC link and Autopilot++ plus plus link and that will bring you to the download. So we want to install um, Autopilot++ plus plus first. So once you um, are on this website, all you need to do on uh, GitHub, all you need to do is click on this uh, .zip file right here and this will download that. So then um, drag this to your desktop and then you can go ahead and um, open it up and then um, this .js file right here go ahead and drag that uh, to your desktop and looks like it's on my other monitor there you are okay so now we can uh, close this out and um, all we need to do is open up a new tab and then drag this um, .js file onto our new tab. And if it says copy, like it does right by my cursor, then we're good and it'll pull up uh, Tamper Monkey. So um, what all we need to do now is just click uh, install. And then it'll bring you to an FDA page. You can close that out. And then if we go to the Tamper Monkey dashboard, you can do this by um, clicking on the Tamper Monkey icon right here. And then go to the uh, dashboard button right here. It'll show you that uh, we have this uh, installed. Would you look at that? So let's go to settings really quickly and um, set uh, general to advanced right here. Um, that will allow us to do um, a ton of uh, other stuff in case you have um, some issues. But really, you shouldn't have to do anything. It should all uh, be pretty basic. So let's go ahead and get FMC. So we just need to do the same thing. Um, I'm going to close this out. Um, we can scroll down here, click on the .zip file, 
This will download it, drag it to desktop, open it up, copy to desktop, close, there it is. And then under new tab, um, drag and drop it, and then click install right here, close it out, and then let's check up on Tamper Monkey. And look at that, it's right there too. It's right there too. So, um, these icons um, really show the sites. Um, I mean, these are uh, fine in their default form. Um, as long as it says like um, HTTPS, as long as it has an HTTPS and then GOFS dot like PHP or dot, uh, dot com or dot or dot this, um, it's, uh, it's fine. So yeah, looks like we're done. Now let's go open up GOFS and see how it runs. So I have a bookmark right here. And what we're going to do right here is we're going to click on Tamper Monkey and let's see, let's click fly. Okay, so it'll give us an error and I'll uh, explain to you why. So first, um, this is really important. This uh, number two shows that we have two scripts running and working. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to disable this because um, I actually haven't flown before on this uh on this uh, particular um, browser, this is an alt account. So I'm gonna reload the page. It'll give us that quick briefing thing or whatever.
yeah, thanks for watching. In the next video, I'll be sure to cover how uh, how to use um, uh, Autopilot++ and FMC with an actual route so you can actually fly somewhere. And the video after, I'll show you how to make your own route. So there's two ways, and I'll show you both ways. So thanks for, uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.